So this is P. P's been to us before, haven't you, sweetie? Oh yes, she says. She's a bit fluffy girl. Very, very fluffy this time around. So she's come in, she's going to have a lion clip. So uh, <clears throat> she's started, you can feel the matting developing underneath this coat. Usual places, round the back of the arms, round the, the hind quarters underneath. So uh, mum likes to keep it short, so she's going to have the full lion and a little bit of shortening just round the face. So we've just done her tootsies. She's very, very good, weren't you? Very good girl. She was. So always do the tootsies first. Just takes uh, some of the danger away from uh, the groomer. And then we're starting on the head. Because uh, we're going to try and keep this lovely bib. Aren't we, P? Yeah, we're going to keep this lovely bib of yours. Just thin it down a little bit. And then start on the clipping. Yeah, she's a good girlie. Yes, where are you going? Mm -hmm. Where do you think you're going to? Right. Let's make a start, Mrs. Mm -hmm. Here we go. <laughs> oh, he says, scratch, scratch my back. Mum has just been telling me that she's got a new cat in the house. And um, this lady is the boss. So she's keeping uh, the new arrival in check. So every time the new pussy cat sort of wanders by, she gives him a quick, uh, quick punch just to let him know who his boss. You pee. It's your house, isn't it? You're the boss. You are. She's letting him know it, aren't you? <laughs> She's got three now. Yeah. yeah. Three pussy cats. She gets on with her, with Sabrina, don't you? But there, there's the new one, because it takes a while for them to sort of find their feet and work out who's the dominant one. And, but I think P was going to keep her spot as the dominate, the the dominate, the dominating cat. I was going to say. Hey, madam. Yes. She's been there the longest, so uh, it's only quite right to be that. That isn't it, Mrs. Is. Hey, your house is. See it. The matriarch. Yes, that's it, the matriarch. That's a good word. <laughs> Very settled there, aren't you, P? Hmm? Very settled there. Thing is, the more often they come to the groomers, the more they know what to expect. Look at this big thick coat coming off. Okay. And the more settled they become on, you know, on each visit, because they know there's nothing to fear. There are lots of lions, aren't there? Come on. Yeah, it's the time of year. Everyone's having lion clips done because the cats, of course, are starting to shed. And as they're shedding those winter woolly coats. They get matted very, very easily. So, um, and with the spring being around the corner, it's easier then. Do a full line clip and then the growth can start back afresh with the new coat. And it's always easier then because as the growth, the, the growth starts back and it's nice and short, uh, all the fur baby mums and dads can keep on top of the coat. Until the next time. Yeah. And a lot of the cats actually prefer it. They, they get a real spring in the step once the coat's off because it's quite heavy and dense, these winter coats. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, P. Bit of action. I wasn't ready here for that. Normally I can feel them sort of tensing up a little bit to jump. 
Where's she going? What is she doing? Oh, look at that. Straight to the cat's bowl, which is empty. Not there, is it? Mm. Yeah, there's an empty cat bowl. Pee oh. <laughs> Pee! Where, where are you going, Pee? I can't leave you like that, can I? Mm. I can't leave you like that, Pee Pee. There you go, baby. She's a cool girl. Suits so you look again, don't you? Hey, you're a good girly. So she's had her full life. She's been very, very patient, haven't you? She's a good girl, actually. She gets a little bit iffy with your, her front feet. That's the only bit she doesn't really take to is under her armpits. I don't know whether it tickles. So when we try and flip under the arms, she tries to pull the arms back, her front legs back. So it makes it a little bit tricky when clipping. But you just have to take it slowly. We go step by step and we get it done eventually, don't we, Pee? Hey, eh? That was your only little tetchy bit, wasn't it? Armpits. Yes. But she loves, looks lovely. Don't you? Hey, look. You. So we leave the tail on, we took the top two, three inch of her tail uh, so that nothing gets stuck when she goes to the toilet. She's had her claws done, groom over of the bib, a little bit of a thin out of the bib. She had a little bit of shape in her own face. And she's all ready to go back in her basket, aren't you? Hey, you're such a sweetie girl. And I want to show you this amazing basket. Now ladies, look at that. That's like a full cap um, handbag, isn't it? That's almost like Louis Vuitton, isn't it? You know, the, uh, the crisscross. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. It's lovely. I'll turn it round. And it's nice, it's got a side opener, so it does open here as well at the front. Uh, but it's the side opener which makes it easy to, to go in. Little fluffy cushion under there. Do you want to go back in your, in your basket, P? Turn it round, yes. Let's pop her in. Here you go. Oh, here you go, madam. In you go. Look at that. How easy is that? It's like a hand pump. Boxy in. Oh, all these bits in your tail. I thought I'd got them out. Okay. There she is. In your handbag. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not that it's not a big big bag, but it's it's just nice for her. She can turn around in it. It's quite sturdy. And uh yeah. It's quite posh, isn't it, P? Hey. Okay. And then it just locks up there. Little catches there and the zip the zip comes right the way around there. And in there. Down there, she's turning around easily there, and then they lock over to on there. Oh, it's because it's new, still a bit stiff. So they they turn and lock. Now let's just see if we can get those to turn and lock. Maybe we have to do that a while before we've got it. We've got a bit of give here. Oh, P, I can't do it. Well, this is a very good recommendation, isn't it? But yeah, you get the gist. As this sort of goes a bit looser, they will just slot into there. There you go. And as they slot in, I don't want to squish pee pee. That will turn and lock. That's a little bit awkward. Because it's new. Nature. It is, it's new and it's stiff. But you get the gist. So without me messing around too much, they turn and lock into that as well. Like a briefcase almost. Yeah. To be honest, the zip is enough. But I would mess with that when you haven't got the cat in it and it's get it used to sort of limbered up a bit. Turn it around later. So there's a little mesh there, so she's looking out there. And the same this side. Mesh this and side. That's as the well. other side. That's just like a full handbag. It's like a handbag thing. Yeah. With the carry strap. Very nice. It is very nice. I might recommend those. Yeah. Put them under the description. You can have a link below. I'll go and find them somewhere if I can. Put them on the uh, 
in the description below. Yeah, nice right. early, early Christmas present Pee -pee. for someone. Yeah, very nice Christmas present for somebody. Okay, back to <laughs> Cheshire then, P. Bye bye.